stuff like that. More sex. That's what I want to do. More sex sir, stuff. Sir, are you, are you all right? Yeah, I just love sweeps, you know. I tell you, I know you can spice up your show, Jake. What is that, sir? You get a big chested blonde model come and sit on my lap. <laughs> sir, we are not going to do that. That's one thing we don't pander oh, to on. on this program. I bet you the audience would want to see that. Wouldn't you want to see that? the audience to dictate what goes on. All right, Mr. Celebrity Hollywood Guy. Don't don't help out the little people. Just don't want to help out the little people. What, sir? What, you, you think, was that going to change your life? If I have a, a what was it, a big-breasted? Big-chested blonde model. That's big, what I want. You right want here. a big-chested blonde model? Bring it up. Will that shut you up? Will that keep you happy? Yes, I'll show you. Fine. Right. You want to do it? No, fine. Vila with some great new hand tools from Sears. Come on. Ow. Ah. Hey, Steve, what's the problem? Uh, Bob, this stupid steak knife doesn't want to turn these screws. That's because you need the right tool for the right job. You need the Crafty Man multi-purpose butter knife. It's several tools in one. Give it a try. Wow. This makes a great screwdriver. Oh, it's not just a screwdriver. It's a paint scraper. Spackling knife. It's great for gardening. Or you can use it to pry things open. Like your daughter's diary. And you can keep it right here in your junk drawer. And best of all, its patented round edge won't go through your hands like that steak knife. <laughs> wow, I'm sold, Bob. The Crafty Man's multi-purpose butter knife has a million uses. Make that a million and one. Hey, would you like a slice? Sure. Crafty Man's multi-purpose butter knife. Available at all Sears locations. We got time for one more quote. Oh, this looks like trouble. Yeah, right. look at this guy. This is Mike Marino from Belmar, New Jersey. Yeah, so I'm a taxi driver. Sure, what's your question? A uh, guy, uh, sometimes when I drink too much, yeah? I have a mishap when I go to use the toilet. You got any advice? <laughs> <laughs> You mean trouble water in the mule, that kind of thing? Uh, driving a porcelain bus? What, what? I fall asleep at the wheel. <laughs> Not... Hey, a lot of guys can't be open and discuss this kind of thing. This is good. Take a look. It's the cops! Pull over, man, pull over! Quick, give me this stuff! Give me this From the stuff. people who brought you real stories of the highway patrol, it's... Grip! Real stories of the Boulder Police. Hey, did you throw all of this stuff from your car? Uh, yes, we took it off, sir. You got it. I'm gonna write you a ticket for littering. <laughs> now you get out of that car and pick this stuff up. Oh, oh yes, uh, we will, officer. Real stories of the Boulder Police. Litter bugs. Oh, yeah, yes, sir. So you had a question? What was it? Yeah, I did. Um, yeah. <clears throat> you know, I watch your show every night, and I, I read a lot about you, and, uh, well, you seem like a really nice, you know, regular guy. Oh, why? Why, well, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> well, I was kind of wondering, and, and I know you're busy, but last night you took that band Jamiroquai to see your car collection. Oh, yeah, we went to my garage and hung out. Yeah, yeah. Well, I was kind of wondering if maybe you would take me to see it sometime. Are you, are you a car guy? You like cars? Yeah, I do. Well, we're almost ready for... We've got a few minutes. The audience is waiting a few hours. They can wait a couple of hours more. Huh? <laughs> Come on, uh, uh, Kev, why don't you uh, entertain a little bit? And uh, I'll be right back. I'm going to show the gentleman. Just, come on, show this guy. Come on, follow me, sir. Me, sir. I'm going to show the clip from Jerry Springer today. Hey, let me tell you something, Jerry, okay? Deep Impact is just a stupid disaster movie. My movie had heart. Titanic's a love story. And for God's sakes, it really happened. 
Personally, I thought the towering inferno had a hundred times more heart than this piece. Who you call a piece of a big bad asteroid? You're gonna end the world. I'm not the power. Yeah, I'm a sick you. Only an iceberg gets to hit the Titanic. I'm sick. these domestic disputes. Police! Problem. He won't leave. He's been drinking eggnog all night. Uh, Come on, buddy. The lady wants you to leave. Hey, I bust my hump every day making toys. And this hey. has supper ready for me when I come over. Calm down. Hey, what are you... Oh, man. Oh, what are you doing? Oh, oh, I can't do that. What are you doing? I'm going to knock you off. Oh, Cucks at the North Pole. <laughs> Picture yourself in a foreign land with Johnny Allegro. Johnny Allegro, world's handsomest garbage man. He's better looking than a Baldwin brother. Do we have anybody? Hey, eat? I'll eat it. Mike, the stage, are you going to eat one? It says do not eat. The guy wants to see somebody eat one. Come on, I'll eat it. Give me it. All right, Joey. <laughs> give him a big care. I don't know what's going to happen when you eat one of these. Hey, I don't know what don't worry about chemical. it. I'm in short. All right, I... You know, you don't have to do it. it <coughs> he's eating the whole thing here. Mike, I'm... Mike, I'm sorry about that. Sorry? Why? She's a great... All right, all right. I will, I'll, I'll be backstage if you need all me. All right, yeah, I'll, see you, I'll be backstage. Here, take a look, take a look. Help! Somebody help me! Oh, look at this. Only when I'm eating. Hey, hold your freaking horses! Look what the sun is doing to my freaking face. Why don't you apply some lipstick to this? They watch New Jersey. Just freaking watch. Folks, we have a great show tonight. Is Jay? Hey, Jay. So, so Quick yeah. question. A question? Sir, this, this, on the monologue. What, what is your question? Well, this joke you did about how Viagra causes blindness. Yeah. You're just making that up, right? I mean, Viagra really doesn't cause blindness, does it?